Hello. Hello, everybody. I'm Shana. I'm Tasha. <laughs> This time, uh, we would like to talk about something a little bit more spiritual, I would yes. say. You could say that. Yes. Which is... So, how are you eating now? I am not very much raw at the moment. I mean, I also have fruit or vegetables every day, but I eat mainly cooked. And I do that for a reason, actually. And um, because I like raw food, but it's always an effort to be raw. And uh, at the moment, I am at a point in my life where I have to, where I have to uh, work on a career or plan a career. I don't know where I have to care about things like a career in business administrations and um, I feel that if I'm eating raw that it's very contraproductive to to the things I have to do at the moment or that I feel I have to do at the moment um, because uh, eating raw changes my way of thinking I really from the inside then I really want different things and that makes it very difficult to be in the normal, in the so-called normal world and um, deal with the things like career planning or exams or meeting uh, business people for interviews or I don't know for getting internships or later jobs. So I do this uh, more or less consciously not eating completely raw at the moment. And, mm -hmm. um, This was interesting because we were having lunch the other day mm -hmm. at the university and I said that <laughs> I was thinking of changing my life and just, you know, the dream of all raw foodists, which is, <laughs> or join a community of raw food or start your own farm or community live natural. so that to live more natural, live more sustainable, grow your own food. Your, yes, grow your own food be in nature so you I changed and um, yes and then she <laughs> realized uh, yeah. she said yes that is it's, it's uh, uh, normal I think that is a consequence yeah it's a consequence of raw food yeah exactly because I said if I would eat raw now I would be thinking just like you and I don't want that at the moment because I want to try the different way of living first. Mm -hmm. Because But she, she did yeah. think like this when she was eating raw. Exactly. So this is very interesting. It changes yes. your mind in a way that... A fundamental way, really. Your tastes and, and your, your... You start to be attracted to different things, more yeah. to nature, um, more it's natural things. Yeah. And yes, it's It's amazing. not just uh, yeah. food or body that's affected, but also your brain in some way. I think this might be chemicals, also chemical reactions in the brain, maybe because I think everybody experiences that, that yes. you don't like watching TV anymore and that you really think that you cannot identify with the people around you anymore because they want so different things from what you want and yeah, that you don't really belong anymore in this uh, regular society and um, that you want to live a different life. like more natural, especially more natural. I mean, I know that I always uh, have a stronger desire than to be outside, to live differently, to really change my life. And well, it's not the time for me to do that now in, in mm -hmm. this way. So I I know what happens when, I, when I'm uh, completely raw and um, this is only one reason. I mean, of course, it's also a matter of discipline that I'm uh, not raw at the moment. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think, well, it's a decision you have to make. Yes. And it's so interesting that you made this decision. I <laughs> think it's very interesting because, yes, um, yes. well, I can imagine. Uh, I think I, I went already more or less through a career, mm -hmm. so I don't have this <laughs> thing, oh, I don't have a career. So yeah, I do have, have a career it. now. So yeah. what I want is to change that <laughs> <laughs> so it makes sense that uh, somebody that uh, still has some ambition and some goals some other goals some besides other goals. being raw or yes. totally healthy i mean luckily i'm not sick so 
yes. there is also not mm-hmm. the urgent need to be raw of course this would be much better for my health but I at the moment I don't have any signs of sickness and mm-hmm. so I don't care so much about it but of course I also know that's not the best approach mm-hmm. but um, I find it really much more difficult to uh, be raw and to think about stuff like a career in the business world because somehow those two ways of thinking don't match they just don't so I think this might be something that more people experience because when she told me this I decided to ask other people how they feel because I know I'm like this but I have always been like this it's just that now with raw food I feel that I'm more myself yeah so I'm more how I really am so I always love nature Mm. I always had this appeal for it and I was never really I'm not saying adapt of course I was always very adapt to the normal world and uh, career and all this yes but I always felt many times uh, this was not my thing yes I always felt many times that I didn't belong in places or I didn't belong in a certain environment or with certain people these Mm. were not really my type of people and now I realize that I'm more near myself this is me and I'm happy with that but uh, and then uh, of course I asked uh, I I thought this was interesting because I thought okay this could be but because I don't see I, I see a big change but it's like more in the direction of what I always was I ask other people so how do you feel I mean was there a big change when you started to eat raw and everybody says yes they all say absolutely (laughs) their life changed completely and some of them came from very toxic lives so I don't know lifestyles like well maybe not hard drugs but you know like going to, drugs, to a bar drinking having a, a beer lot, regularly yes, smoking like um, I don't know what they were doing but you know the ordinary <laughs> that, that's lifestyle how, yes describe it yes. less, yeah, <laughs> <maybe>. <laughs> and uh, yes they all say they changed completely even spiritually so they became more aware yes. of their um, of spirituality I mean it's not that you become some for instance I think I'm still not there <laughs> in this part <laughs> I was never very spiritual spiritual to maybe, begin with, maybe yes I'm very more down to earth person. and very science and very but uh, I can understand that because I can feel that I'm getting a little bit more open and, and more interested also and more also. interested and more yes like maybe having experiences that I never had before and uh, I liked it it's not that I, I like it so I yes it's interesting mm-hmm. that um, yes eating raw be prepared so this is because if you do it for real if you really go for it it's a real change you will change and yes. you will change your brain and your mind uh, we said this before but and you will change also yes y- your life mm-hmm. I mean, really your life if you so if you your really interests. want to be raw you really want to you really need to want that because otherwise you probably will not get there because you have to be in it with your heart and mind so to say and uh, that's really a commitment also I think because uh, I for instance I don't want it that badly at the moment so I I just don't do it because mm-hmm. if I really would want it now I would do it I think but I'm not ready for a change like that yet yes because it is a big change yes. so you have to be ready or maybe you if you have a disease then um, I also talk with people who had diseases mm-hmm. so many people be- start to eat raw because they, they had, had a, a, a disease, fatal disease a chronic, yeah. Yeah, chronic disease and well they all got better of course and then yeah. the commitment is much bigger because <laughs> yes. well you are healthy again wow that's really yes. an achievement yes. and uh, uh, yeah. you want to keep it you want to course. keep it of course so the change is 
overall it's uh, a big change. Yeah. You have to want a change. Yes. So, of course, when you start to eat raw, th that's already a big change. So, but you have to want it. Okay, I want to change my life. I want to change mm. something. And then you have to do it like that. But it's a good thing because it's more natural and more who you are probably. Because I also always like to be in nature and like fresh things and good food. Um, and so this might be also a little bit stupid not to do it for career reasons but I have to find out for myself in of the course. end and, um, but I also uh, feel the more time I spend with my raw food friends like Tasha for example the more uh, I want to be raw again so this is all correlated in some way I think it's mm -hmm. uh, interesting to observe <laughs> maybe you know first you experience all the career yes. I mean all the career no career or um, a job and see mm -hmm. how it works and then maybe you can make a decision after yes. later if you want yes it's not a final decision or anything I still try to eat a lot of raw uh, food but but not 100% so because then the changes really start if you just eat a lot of raw food it's okay then you can live a normal life you can go out for dinner with friends still or I don't know, have a, a business lunch or whatever <laughs> could happen. It's a little bit more difficult. <laughs> yeah. Well, you can have a lunch and afterwards have your own yes. food again. So. I mean, you can have a salad. Yeah. But, uh, yes. If it's nice there is salad at the stressful. moment, it's yes. difficult. That, is, a, yeah, with that is another problem <laughs> here now in Germany that uh, because of E. coli, you know, mm -hmm. this big virus uh, uh, panic. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yes, it's yeah. hard to find a salad. There's no salad <laughs> in the restaurants anymore. And at the university yeah. also not. I mean, very little. There Cooked is salad. Very little, <laughs> yes, very little variety. Yeah, it's funny. So I now eat uh, fruit. At least I have a fruit salad. Yeah. So that's good. That she delicious. showed me the fruit yes. salad. Um, but expensive. But yeah. okay. At the moment, good. the choices are a little bit limited. Yes. Mm. And that's well, so then so <laughs> keep in mind that the raw diet will come with a lot of change <laughs> overall. Exactly. So if you really are looking for a change, that's a good <laughs> a good it. option because <laughs> you will get it. If you're not, then well, you can try it and see how. Well, it if goes, it's too much, just eat a lot of raw food. Yes, you as don't have to do possible. it uh, yeah. one hundred percent yet. Yes. Just whenever you're ready. Go for it. As much as possible, raw food in your life is healthy, so it doesn't yeah. matter if you go yes. 100% or 50 or I absolutely agree. Or no percent, it's just what yeah. you want. <laughs> okay. Okay, then see you next time. Yes. Bye bye.